coronary arteries are the major blood supply to the heart. There's a left and right coronary artery. These coronary arteries bring oxygen, nutrients via the blood flow to the heart. Blocked or diseased coronary arteries can prevent this from happening. The blockage in the coronary arteries is actually a build-up of plaque and calcium and this actually causes narrowing of the coronary artery and reduces the blood supply to the heart. Risk factors causing this include family history, cigarette smoking, poor control of blood pressure, high cholesterol and poorly controlled diabetes. You can treat coronary artery disease, there are many people in the community living with this. Treatment in the first instance involves lifestyle changes, things such as quitting smoking, eating a healthy diet, regular exercise, as well as attention to diabetes, high cholesterol and high blood pressure. In cases where the disease has progressed and people are having significant symptoms or present with a heart attack, then these patients will often need procedures such as insertion of stent or in severe cases coronary artery bypass surgery. The symptoms that people may have include chest pain, shortness of breath and in severe cases where there's a complete blockage of a coronary artery people may present with a heart attack to hospital. There are many people in the community living with coronary artery disease on a day-to-day -day basis. These people, when managed well by their specialists and their general practitioner, will live a relatively normal life. If you have high risk factors for coronary artery disease, such as high blood pressure, high cholesterol, are a cigarette smoker either previously or currently, have diabetes or a strong family history, then it's important to talk to your doctor. Coronary artery disease is preventable. Things such as lifestyle changes are important. Regular exercise, quitting smoking, eating a healthy diet, as well as good maintenance of your diabetes, your blood pressure and cholesterol.